thanks to you, Lord, with all my heart, I will tell of your wonderful deeds. Psalm 9, verse 1. Hey, people, welcome back to another video. Thank you guys for subscribing. Thank you guys for tuning in. I am super, super grateful. Today is just a little get ready with me video. I'm late for church. This is a get ready with me um, for um, church and I'm really late. But I just thought I would record this video and show you guys what I would look like. I was really excited to record this video because this is the first time I am wearing eyeshadow in over eight months. In eight months almost nine months this would be the first time i'm wearing eyeshadow and i think i do like the look i used the nyx um palette i went to um my local store or something i just went to a store i went to boots actually and i saw the palette i was like you know what let me get it i've not had eyeshadow in forever and i would like to do like little makeup tutorials let me just get one and i do like the look i like the end products really easy really simple i hope you guys will learn a thing or two and if you don't i hope you just enjoy well i hope you do but yes this is the look that i came up with just really easy gold i'm a gold person so i definitely run for the gold i do like it i hope you guys will enjoy this video and i will see you guys in my next video bye so here i'm just using my edge control i really like this edge control it really works well with my hair it doesn't give that white residue or whatever the case may be here i'm just trying to you know slay my edges i don't know how to do this but i think i did a pretty good job because i was feeling pretty fly with myself and all of that and um yeah i did like it um here i'm just trying to do my brows real quick i'm using the um, Rimmel london um, brow pencil i think that's what i used to um, achieve this look <laughs> So here I'm just trying to clean under my brow. I'm using um, the um, LA Girl concealer to um, clean under the brow. And I think I'm using the color fawn. That's what I use for under my brows. And um, I'm just here trying to buff that all into my skin just to give that really nice look. Um, for the top part, I use my Zaron um, concealer in Earth. I do like this um, concealer for my skin tone. And it just works pretty well basically for me i do the same thing by cleaning up um the concealer on top with um, a brush i think all the brushes i use are from zoeva and here i'm just trying to you know make that brow look all flaky and all slicky now i'm using my foundation the nyx foundation the can't stop on stop foundation and trust me this foundation is good for all the girls out there, I would recommend this foundation. It's not expensive at all. I got it from Boots. I can't remember how much I got it, but it's really good. Keeps me matte all day. I'm in love. I use the shade um, Sable. Goes well with my skin tone. Just amazing. Here, I'm just trying to powder my eyelid. I wasn't really sure what I was trying to do, so I just picked up my concealer because it's been a while I've used eyeshadow and I was just trying to, like, you know, get something done. So I'm just trying to conceal under my eyes my chin my forehead you know all the things that we do i'm using my um brush now to just blend that um concealer into my skin as i'm um, you know as good as i can so basically that's what i'm doing here i don't really use um the sponge i would like to use it but trust me i don't have any good ones so i just stick with my you know brush and then i go back with my foundation brush to just you know blend out whatever harsh lines that may come up that's what i'm doing here now I'm using my black upper powder to just set all the places that I highlighted um, on my face. And then I go in with my NYX eyeshadow palette. Started using the color and it was just like pow on my face. I was like, okay. I didn't like the consistency of the eyeshadow, but I just kept on using it still. I tried to go in with another color, but I realized that it was still giving me that red on the tone. And I just was not bothered. I didn't want to continue looking all red like I am a tanga. So I decided to just leave it. Now I'm going in with my um gold a gold um color from the palette just to put on my lids, just give that nice look, you know, looking all fly and slicky. And then I'm blending that gold in with the red, just you know, blending. Don't be too much of harsh lines or anything. And then I'm just dusting off the excess powder that was under my eyes. Yep, that's what I'm doing here. I go in with my eyeliner from Maybelline. This is the way I can line my eye, best line my eyes as, 
easy as possible to avoid any form of flooding from my eyes i pick up one of the colors back from the um, palette and just use that right under my eyes where i have lined i go back in with my um, black upper powder to just set my the bridge of my nose and my chin just kind of give me a little bit of a you know cheeky cheeky bone trying to set my nose here using my um i think i use my slick um palette that's what i used to set so i'm just contouring my cheek you know all the places that need to be contoured my cheekbone under my face my forehead just under my face under my chin under my face <laughs> under my chin because yes i have added a bit of weight and i'm just dusting off the excess powder that i had on my face i'm going in with my elf from blush palette to just you know give a little color to my face and then i'm going to use the maybelline chrome highlighter to just put um on the brow bone the inner tear, my inner tear ducts um, the bridge of my nose on the tip of my nose just to contour just to give that glow I'm also going to use it on my cheekbone. I don't I really don't like the way it looks on my cheek But I still use it all the same. I think by the time I go out and also this on my face It ends up looking really nice. So that's what I'm just doing here trying to just give that glow Using my Zaron high um, setting spray to just set my my face and then I'm going in with my Zaron uh, mascara to just you know mascara up my eyelashes if they would cooperate to me <laughs> now i'm trying to do my hair i'm using the ponytail i got from my local beauty store i can't remember the name of the hair that i bought but yeah it, i got it in a hurry so it wasn't of like really good quality and all um this is my first time of using a ponytail i was really scared i was like oh my god this is going to work out i see people use it on youtube it seems so easy to put and i do it blah, blah. i wish i had a lot of thoughts in my head like at that time i was just like oh my gosh i hope this will work out but it ended up looking really nice i'm just brushing through the hair i'm showing you it has two combs on top and on the bottom and i'm just trying to clip that on my hair right now here i was just thinking oh this thing is not going to fall off because it will not be funny if it falls off well at the end i think it worked out pretty well so guys this is the finished product I'm really loving this look like ooh, I feel good -na 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 -na. and as usual this is my eye oh I have really sensitive eyes will just tear up I just hope and pray that before I get to church this whole eye makeup is still on because sometimes you could just stare up and just disappear into thin air but I really like this look. This is my first time of using a ponytail and I really like it. I'm just really scared. I just hope that it doesn't unravel like the way I wrapped the thingy round. I don't know if you can see. The way I wrapped it round, nobody should come for me like this. So I've never done this before and I really like it. I just think I'm going to be really conscious of it. I don't even know how many inches this is. I didn't even check. How many inches this is but this seems to be pretty long um it's not that bad i really don't like the way it's it when you hold it it feels a bit thin but i guess it doesn't look that bad hubby says it looks good so we'll take it like that sorry if i keep cleaning my eyes it's just so what i'm saying like if you can see that 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 place is already gone somewhat somewhat gone like before the end of the day under my eye the concealer would have disappeared but i really love this makeup look mm. give it to them girl let's go and praise god 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 let's go and praise praise god i'm here dancing like i'm really i'm really lit service has started church is on and i'm here singing and dancing but yeah i really really love this look you guys should tell me what you think do you like this look do you want me to do this look just let me know so this is going to be like my my look for the week i just relaxed my hair 
So this will be my look for the week so I have something to do to my hair. Really, really, really love this. Thank you guys for watching this video. Thank you for tuning in. Don't forget to subscribe, to like this video, and to also share the video. Also, don't forget to turn on your post notifications so you can get alerts whenever I post videos. Leave a comment below letting me know how I did, what I should do better if you like the look. Just, you know, just let me know what to do, what not to do. My next video and all you what am i doing like this one what is this <laughs> you guys should just let me know i really enjoyed you know putting on this makeup i really love the look I, I look so slick in my black turtleneck i'm gonna do an outfit and show you guys what she is wearing huh <laughs> well i really really like this look on I hope you guys enjoyed this um, video. As I said, don't forget to subscribe, to share, and to turn on your post notification. I'll see you guys in my next video. God loves you, so do I.